I'm really aligning uh, the marketing and sales team around sales qualified opportunities, um, not leads, for example. While we do produce leads and marketing qualified leads, sales qualified opportunities is where the rubber meets the road. And that's really has full alignment between the sales development team, the marketing team and the sales team. Now there is a positive trend in the last few years that I've seen where I would call it a re-centralization of data and processes. So with the advent of data lakes and cloud data warehouses like Redshift and Snowflake and others, there's the ability to centralize data and then obviously um, use business intelligence to report back on it. And then making sure that you've developed metrics that um, can be reported accurately uh, from one source of truth. There's a lot to, to do in terms of alignment. Obviously, number one, strategy and goals where the leadership is aligned. Um, number two is metrics that are uh, both defined and how they're measured and who the owner is. Uh, number three is the centralization of data in general. This, this is more about um, single source of truth. And number four is um, tools that help you execute the journey across sales and marketing that have full visibility and control for everyone in those organizations. And the, if you do those four things, I think your alignment is going to be pretty good. Uh, it's never going to be perfect, but um, but it, hopefully this will give you a, a sense of like the, the major buckets you can work through to really achieve that alignment. And we're all here for the same reason, right? And that is to grow uh, annual recurring revenue uh, faster and faster. Mm -hmm.